and welcome back to the next episode of Modern Skyblock 2 with Wayno. I'm just making more uh, episodes to see. Okay, so these would remain inside. I mean, we need some for this. So put that away. Um, splash potion of healing. Let's. What was that one? That's a regeneration that's healing. Oh, okay. So we have them two there. So that will slowly remove them. I'm going to put this at this end here, right at the end. So this will be the last pipe. I think you... No, you need to do an upgrade. Gravel, I think it is on it. It's been a while since I've done it. And then that will be the last point. So anything that doesn't fit will go into there. Which... Pretty much it is. How much I've got? I've got two drawers left. So let's... So, really nothing else. I don't really need any of that stuff. So, but I will run this all the way down to here. I will probably get a... Uh, I know it's a certain... duck that you can use. Interesting. Well, I didn't know those were in here. Well, that's pretty cool. Uh, unless they've taken it out. used to do gravel with it and it used to be like a last line of some sort but I don't think you can actually make them anymore huh well they must have changed something in it oh that that's no fun for me then is it Oops, I want them back. And enable that. We'll suck everything out, and hopefully none of it went in here. It could be a servo now, but... We'll see. This will be quite slow for now. Yeah. I want to see if... My thing underneath... Ooh, this is bad. Yeah. If my water wheel is actually keeping up with it. Yeah, it looks like it is. Four million. Sweet. So... And this is actually... Turned it off. Well, that worked out perfectly. Let's see what this is on. Oh, there it is. So they even changed the wand upgrade. And that is full. So that is on perfect par. Look at that. Absolutely perfect. I'm quite pleased with that. I wasn't aiming for it to be like that, but hey. I just laid it down and it came out to be exactly how I wanted. Now this is all gone, so there should be stuff inside that. Um, I'll just leave them there for now. But I should actually make some um, blood orbs so I can get myself some pistons. So I'll keep that there for now. Put that there. There we go, you can have 11. Uh, we'll need lots of these, so. <laughs> Let that fill up. There we go. I know you can get some speed upgrades somehow, but I don't know. I should look in the, in the book actually. Lightning grenade, a potentia sphere. Uh, sphere. Uh, okay. Not too sure 
what can go in there. Okay, and there's 12 buckets of blood. So this will actually fill up even more. I should really get the uh, promise of tenacity too, because yeah, that's just a block of gold, 4,000. And that increases this to like 160,000 or something like that. So it's quite a lot. So. Um, I shouldn't move all them into that too, shouldn't I? Oh well. Worry about that later. Just get this stuff working. So we have quite a bit of obsidian now, yay. And we hit here, and then that, and then that. Actually need a little bit more. We don't actually need to, whoa. Uh, there. We don't need to do every single one of them, because some of them will take ages to fill. But we need to do that one, that one, that one. Probably these two, this, 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 uh, and that. So we actually nearly filled it all up straight away. So that's good. So let's have a look. So we emptied it all in here, and we nearly have our first blood orb. So then we can jam this and make it into a um, uh, empowered Restonia. So the only problem is you can choose between to do a block, right? Which will give you nine, but the problem is they're like 50 million power or something ridiculous anyway. So that one water wheel would take a while to actually fill it. Uh, yeah, 50 million RF, which we're, n we're not even close to making that yet. We're not even not even close enough. So we could actually still just do one at a time. I know it seems like a waste because you could do nine, but we don't have the storage unless I make um, a couple of storages. So, but we just don't have the production value at the moment of making them. Uh, making it. So we need to look up into more power. So, but we'll we'll do this for now anyway. So we need to make one of these, which is redstone and ender eye and rest. Uh, what was it called? So one of them. I know we've got them. Uh, resonating crystal. So one of them and one of these. So we do that, and then we need some nether brick. What's the easiest way to get netherrack? It's just that way. So, do we have any spares? No. Uh, we do have gunpowder, however. There we go, a little bit of gunpowder and only 18 cobble. Oh, we have more than 18 cobble. Had quite a bit laying there. So, put that in. We got 38. So this would actually give us a stack if we go to 24. So we do this and this. And there we go. We whack that in there and it'll give us our bricks. Then we that's for and then we need nether wart. We got quite a bit of nether wart. We really should. These all should be in a farm. I should just go ahead and make the magma crucible so I can get a farmer. And I'm pretty sure that what I plant, what stays, but I'm not 100% sure. I've only ever used it for canola, uh, canola seeds, so. Okay, should be carrying 
farming melons and pumpkins, cactus, netherwort. Uh, so I think it's just what's underneath it, I think. So for now we don't need that many because we're only making one. So that's four. And the last thing is. An apple. That's why I was carrying that apple around with me. Oops. Uh, put you away, you away. Uh, let's see if this is emptied. No, of course it wouldn't be empty because I'm not cooking anything. Ah, uh, more iron. And tin and cobalt can go in. So that will actually start using all of that. So let's just put this down. And oh, <laughs> uh, I should really just make a block and just wait because that's nine. And it's so much easier, but it will drain all that power. I should actually do another second um, water wheel, shouldn't I? because that will give us at least a hundred power per tick so it won't it will still drain all a lot of our power but I think I'll just do one for now and I can make a couple of them so, but we need to work out the power already done See, first redstonia or empowered redstonia crystal and I have no clue what I'm gonna make with it <laughs> I could make a piston to get something. Um, uh, let's have a look in here because oh, could could actually start the digital age. We've got a, applied alarm logistics and refined storage. So currently you can use the applied alarm logistics to sort stuff you're going to need. A lot of certus quartz, silicon and flux crystals. Where uh, With these basic components, blah blah blah, you can read that. Uh, if you rather refined storage, which I actually prefer refined storage, you can switch to it or just keep it entirely until you can make a chemical reactor. To make an RS system, all you need to do is enriched iron and silicon, or quartz enriched iron. So let's have a quick look at. Um, God damn it, it's, it's just slipped my mind. RS, that's all I can think of at the moment. Refined storage. Wow, that my brain just had a fart. It just died. So I actually prefer refined storage. It is a lot better. So, and to get silicon, you have... You can actually just cook it up. So nether quartz or service quartz. Service quartz is quite easy to get, so that's easy. But this one here, you need a chemical reactor and actually combine it, which is... Advanced uh, extractor, compressor, extractor, so invar plates. So we can actually get everything here, the, the, except the empowered palace crystals, because you need to actually start in stardust, which is actually isn't too hard. All you need to do is just do a few uh, rock crushers, and and um, the the only actually other thing is really hard to get by is. this stuff. No. Blue dye actually, sorry. It has to be done in a crusher and it has a 5% chance to give you blue dye. Literally. This is the only way to actually get blue dye in this game. And it is oh, so problematic. Um, yeah. You, you're going to end up having to auto craft it all just to just, yeah. Because you can't actually get it from um, from here either so um, let's see how much blue I have so even if I use this to grind it up so into the pedal um, yeah see it, it it's not it's only used in botania stuff unless you can get blue wool in another way So 
that turns it to mana powder, uh, greenhouse stuff, into a wax, into stellar refraction table, whatever that hell is. But yeah, you Yeah, you, to get it, just to get some wool, or oh, a blue dye, sorry, um, yeah, the only way to get it is through this, you need to make blue wool, and then you do the blue wool could be, yeah, so you can use Botania to get your blue wool, but you still have to crush it to get your blue dye. The only way to get it, and uh, it's terrible. I, out of 64, well, out of 64, you may get one to four, and that's what I used to get when I was just. It is just incredibly hard. So, not really hard. It's just time-consuming because you've got to set it up and let it, let it go. So, yeah, can't get that at the moment, but I can make a, a rolling machine. Uh, actually, no, because the rolling machine still uses advanced crystals. So, yeah, you still can't get this. But I can get the pistons now. So, if I actually click there. Oops. So, a piston. See? You get a piston. And pistons, I can actually make the crusher now crafting machine which I have no clue uh, you can't do them but that's for tinkers yet yeah. uh, mechanism so you can actually make your own auto sorters and stuff like that a mana ball lens lock up data so we can actually make some heavy machinery blocks we can make the metal former we actually make the planter now sower but to get into that is just going to be uh, to die and then to get the tiny die you need to put some stuff next to it so pistons seem to be the next thing to do um, so I think I might actually head into refined storage um, but unfortunately uh, we were stuck on making the quartz iron I think it was uh, yeah because you need the chemical reactor and you need them. I mean, I can quickly duck into um, uh, what do you call it? The the, the star one. Um, God damn it! Oh, no, I can't remember off the top of my head what it's called. Uh, it's just astral sorcery. That's the one. Um, yeah, I can jump into astral sorcery and quickly make them, but I don't really need it because I can actually do applied logistics. Which is exactly like uh, applied energistics, but I think they. This is applied energistics one. Uh, I haven't used applied energistics two or one in a long time, so no. This is this is two because number one was the other one, uh, the one with the actual crafting units and the big storage. So I can enter this. But the only problem is I need more power. And to get more power, we need to either go into the other generators. Uh, well, which we can make a coal generator, but that only does 80 RF a tick. We can go into the oil generators. Um, but we need to grow and harvest canola automatically, which we can do it in the farm over there, I think it was. Or we can make a cloche. I guess we could do a thermal one. Mm. Or oh, actually, we could have a look at immersive engineering. Oh, that won't help. Because um, I'm pretty sure we should be able to make a diesel generator. Oh, what's a thermionic? Oh, that's that thing. That's generation one. Is there more than one gen? Is that 200k before it wears out? 
And what's it saying generation one? Is there the more than one generation? And is that 200k for the ice? Block uranium, eulorium, and plutonium block, which you wouldn't need because you'll be using steam anyway. Because I jumped in basically straight into um, big reactors. Uh, it's not called big reactors, it's called extreme reactors. wonder why that comes up under big still. It's all the same. So I could actually go into this because you need to make all these casings before you can go into this stuff. The only problem is I was using liquid endar in mine because the endar tears. So I could use something else to cool it down with water or redstone block. It doesn't actually give you a book to actually follow by, so it's really weird that. You need to go online to find out what to call it by. See, everything's pretty easy to make. I mean, I could make heap of these. The only problem is, is the way that you waste energy in it and turning it on and off because the computer port in the other one actually didn't work with open computers and it didn't work and it sucked. It just wouldn't work with it and you would, lo you would waste so much power. In, in it, so I think I might skip on that and, and um, if I do the oil generators right, because they're actually really easy to make, they're just, they're just your basic casings oh uh, uh, they've changed the recipe, you evil man They've changed the recipe to ref refined casing, which is in binnies, which is iron plates and invar plates. When they used to be, uh, yeah, they used to be the refined iron. Yeah, so you refine iron ignit, ingot, and it's either through the smeltery or through a metal press. And to make them was just to cook it up. Ha! Huh. That evil, evil man keeps changing these recipes. Pixel! So, yeah. We're going to have to, I think, make a metal press. So, I mean, it will take me some time to make these. It'll be hell easy to do. So, it's just, yeah, just adapting to the new recipe that he's done. So, you're even going through this to get, you know, iron casing, refined casing. Ugh. Okay then, um, make a metal press, um, because it won't make it in the compacting one. Interesting. Uh, so let's quickly test this. It won't work because JEI is fairly smart, so, and it tells you what you can and can't put in here, but we'll see. Ah, uh, no, that's the wrong one. Ha, huh. because I wanted refined iron, not in bar. In fine iron. And the progress bar is at 0%. So, I prefer. Um, oh. Um, I don't know what's looking in there. Um, uh, immersive engineering. So what we needed, I think it was, oh, I was looking at power. The diesel generator, you need, so you need every, you need a farm to automate any of this, so, and also you need to be in a fluid tank and a squeezer and all this other stuff, so there's only really, there's several different power generations, is you got the, well, the kinetic dynamo connected to a water wheel or a windmill. So, power generation 3. Huh. So, is water wheel, I mean, wind better than water? Power generation 4? I wonder what it means by that. See, so that's, that's 3. And that's using the windmill blade. 
So what's this one then? That's a two. So might be better off doing it with a windmill sail generation. So you make this and then you add this to it. I wonder if it changes one at a time, because that's eight on there, so hmm, interesting. I might have to actually look at this. Because this it says power generation two. And the diesel generator well is a multi-block, so you can't actually see what it says, what power generation it is. But that would probably be generation 5 then. So, because if you look, that's 1, that's 2, that's 3, that's 4. Hmm, I might have to have a look online through the break on that. But that seems interesting. Because if you go back to the. Not that one. This one. That's power generation 1. So, is that the stages that it's in? Because this still connects to the dynamo. I'm really interested to see what I'll get out with this now. Because I really love, I, I love the passive generations of these. So I wonder, though, do I have any hemp? I don't think I do. Oh look at that! Ha ha! Look, we have cows. Moo, 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 and we have two piggies. So all we're missing is sheep. But so that's uh, that's cool. And llamas, sheep and llamas. Um, that's right, I was coming out here to check for hemp. Uh, coffee, rice, pumpkin. We got hops! There we go, right there. So, we do have two. So we could actually make this. I'm really interested in this now. Because for me to get anywhere to actually, I need to make a garden cloche. That 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 that's it. Every anything to power generation. See so uh, what is there? Uh, big reactors will use eulorium, and it needs to be controlled by something. Um, I know this is. I need. You need to make the. And we need pallets for this. Ah, uh, we can't make the cloche. Okay. So unless we go with something that gives more production wise hmm um because we don't have end io so we can't make the generators anyway uh because we would just use potato and sugar and redstone gunpowder something like that anyway um hmm. i might have to go through the pack to see what power generation there is and come back next episode and tell you which way we're going. And look at that, see? See, look how much. 17 buckets of blood. And this will just fill up. Oh, we got eight. So, yeah. It's a hell of a lot. So let's see what's this coming into. See, it's actually siphoning all, only the stuff that can't go in here by the look of it. So that's good. So those two will be something that's actually important. So yeah. So that is uh, wrapping up point anyway. We're at the 30 minute mark now. And um, I will have a look to see what 
way of power to go because with one water wheel we need a hell of a lot more power I mean to do a lot of the stuff 50 million RF in here I need to work out where to store it I mean I could do a um, what 50 million in these so that's four so you'd need like freaking 10 of the, the damn things to hold 40 million but we'll have a look anyway so I will have a think about it and I'll get back to you in the next episode on which way the power will go anyway that is it for today so thanks for watching give me a like subscribe thumbs up thumbs down leave a comment I don't know um, yeah um, well you have fun anyway so laters